so sometimes you'll come across the problem in Soul Knight multiplayer that just your friend's IP address is not popping up, your friend's name is not popping up at all, and you can't do anything to fix it. Thankfully, there are actually a lot of solutions to this problem. Hello everybody and welcome back to the to the Top Games Guys channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to fix Soul Knight multiplayer, because you possibly could have made a mistake when setting up your Soul Knight multiplayer, or just are having some problems in Soul Knight multiplayer that is causing Soul Knight multiplayer to not work. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can fix Soul Knight multiplayer's not working screen, and make it actually work for you, and have you and your friends be able to have a great time playing Soul Knight together. So let's get right into a few of the common problems after a message from the subscribe button. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate every little bit of the support you guys can give me. So please subscribe and let's get back into the video. One of them is that you actually have to manually enter the IP. You can find the IP address in a lot of different ways. It really depends on your device. So I highly recommend you look up a specific guide for your device on how you can find your IP. For me, let's just randomly put in some numbers. Just see. It's obviously not going to work just because, well, first of all, I'm not even trying to host anything right now. But if I were, and let's say that was my friend's IP address, I could put that in, and you'll see that was not even the right format for one. But if it was, then it would have an easier time working for you. Another common problem people have is that Soul Knight multiplayer doesn't work great on public Wi-Fi networks because devices are hidden from each other. That's just something that's coded into your device and is very, very hard to get around. However, there are ways to get around it, like using a mobile hotspot instead of a Wi-Fi network. Basically, every device has mobile hotspots built in if it has a cellular data plan and is a modern phone, so I would highly recommend trying to use a mobile hotspot instead of a Wi-Fi network. But if you absolutely have to use a Wi-Fi network, either manually use that IP function to connect to each other, or use a private Wi-Fi connection like a personal home Wi-Fi system. Another alternative that I would highly recommend is, let's say one of you can't find the other in the join game section, just switch and go over to hosting. Try hosting a game instead of joining one. That can also be really helpful in just making sure that you've tried every option and exhausted every option. Another thing that could be causing it to go wrong is make sure you're using the same game version. You'll see that I'm using V3.2.7, but if you're not, you may need to go over to the Play Store by going to the home page of your device, going to the Play Store or the iOS App Store, and making sure that you have the latest version of Soul Knight installed, because you see they do update it relatively frequently. Make sure that you are both on the same version. As you'll see, the last game update was August 23rd, 2021, as of the time of this recording, but if you're still in a version from, let's say, 2017 when it came out, it's not going to go very well for you. So I highly recommend you make sure that you are both using the same version. So hopefully this guide on how to fix Soul Knight multiplayer was helpful for you because I've personally had some problems with Soul Knight multiplayer not working, and it's really annoying when you're just trying to play with your friends. So I hope this guide was helpful. If it was, please hit like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.